Okay, I have a couple of go-to moves that I'm most likely to do to one of my images. And my first go-to move is going to be to add contrast. A lot of times the auto button is conservative. So I will generally go and slide contrast a bit to the right just to give it more juice. Doing that usually makes your image more colorful. So I'm going to bump up the contrast and then I'm going to do a trick that I do to almost all of my outdoor travel images. It works wonders. I usually take the highlights to minus 100 and it works wonders on skies. So that's why I do it and you're not going to lose anything appreciable there. So I'm going to drag the highlight slider to minus 100. And did you see what it did? See how it's bringing depth and dimension into the sky as I move that back and forth? So I'm gonna leave it at 100. If you love photography and you have an iPhone, then join us this March at the iPhone Photography Conference. Sign up at kelby1live.com.